All right, so this is how I um chaining. This is a watch called Skigin. Skigin, see there? Skigin. So the way I have to change this glass is cracked, so I already opened it up, but I just want to show you a demo of how I did it. Why did I take an exacto knife and then I and then I um put stick it in between like this and I go all the way around, all the way around like that until it loosens up and then I just stick it and then then I just put the uh, knife in there and, and I dig it out. I'm gonna pass for a second as I put it on a tripod. See all these other watches I got. Yeah, I'm fixing it for the family. This one here is um this one here I put the new battery in but it won't spin so I gotta check it out. Oh this is the new glass for the Skagen watch. S K A G E N I just bought it today. A reasonable price. I got it from the Chinese man at the flea market that I was at earlier today. So we're gonna change that. This is the glass. He should fit it should fit over there. So I'll just just for the thing I'll just just for demo I'm gonna show how it fits over there like that. And then I gotta glue it so I put some glue and then he said this was the closest one to that. Oh it's a little too big. It might fit. I'ma try. If it doesn't, well, I'm going to try to file it down to the right level. Okay, I'll be, I'll be sending another video in a minute. Alright, this is Wild Tiger here. I'm doing, um, I'm repairing a Skagen watch. Oops. Alright, so this is a Skagen watch. See, um, I bought the glass. I changed the battery, it was a tw uh, 1216 battery, I can see, let me see if I can bring it up closer, yeah, this is a 2016 battery, see, 2016, no, this is not a 2016, this is a 364, I believe, battery, uh, it's hard to see, but it's there somewhere, but anyway, I changed the battery, and the, the back, I didn't close the back yet, uh, which, this is here, but the problem was the, the glass, See the glass is <coughs> the glass is out. See, but I did. I had to take this. Um, I had to take this exacto knife, and then and then cut around, cut around the inside of it. You know, like here the edge, all the way around. I got the glass out. See, this is the glass. This is a part of the glass. The whole piece of glass is here. So this is the whole glass it was cracked up, so I wanted to change it. So I went to the watch, the watchman, the Chinese man, and he give me, he give me another glass. But the thing was, the glass was a little too big. So guess what I did? I took my sander, I took a sand, a file, a nail file, and I sanded the glass down. Let me show you. So this is the glass. Took the glass, took my nail file, and I ran it like this on it to make it. Thing to fit, so when I'm done now, I got it to fit. I want to do it a little bit more so I can get it. So, this is this is me sanding this. Um, this is me sanding the uh, sanding the glass. This is the glass. What I did was I put piece, two pieces of tape so I don't scratch the glass in the middle, and then I just marked it where I have to sand. So, that's why I see here it is. That's why I got the markings because it's going to be sanded and then it fits. Let me empty this. So see, as you can see, it's eh, there. There's no glass on this. So I marked it. See, nice skigging watch. I like it. So there's the skigging watch. What I did, I marked it on the half. I don't know if you can see that, but I marked the half. Let me see. And then I sanded it and now it fits. See that? Before it wasn't fitting. There you go. See now I can I can adhesive, I can put the adhesive now and stick it. Um, but the problem is it's still a little sticking out a little bit. So what I will do is you see here? I don't know if you can see. Yeah, you can see. So um oh, I think the flash was off, that's why. Okay. Alright, that's better. Now we can see. So see here the um as you can see the, the glass fits but there's a little bit of edge needs to be sanded which I'll do. It's 
I could feel it and I can tell so you can't just see it you gotta feel so I can feel and see that the rough edge is still sticking up a little bit so what I'll do is do a little bit more sanding on it to get it flat a little bit more flat which see it's just a little bit sticking out but I gotta sand it some more earlier on <coughs> from I think from here to here here to here until it gets a little more uh, uh, fits a little more better and a flat a little bit more flat because right now I know it's not fitting all the way but I could have stuck stuck it like that but it'll be sticking out so I want it a little better I want to be perfect so uh, what I'm doing is I'm gonna sand it some more so I'll take the glass like so put it on my sandpaper like this I'm just gonna show you briefly because I've been sanding a while and then I go like that see the glass this is the glass and then I'll sand it down like so until it gets to the right um, size I need a caliper I have to buy one of those small calipers that you just put the, put it between the glass and you know how much the size would be and that so that's my next buy and I, I went to the flea market today and I got this from the watch the watch repair guy and um, he didn't give me the right size but you know maybe he don't have it so I, I'm filing it down I'm filing it down or sanding it down with a nail file so that way it doesn't scratch the glass I think this is better than a, a regular file so this will do as long as I get the right size of the of the lens then, then I can put it there and then take my uh, adhesive as you can see, I have more watches I've been working on. Some of them, it was hard, the back was hard to close. The, I saw the tiny man, what he did was, he took this one, I broke this watch years, um, last two years ago, I was. I broke it, and now I see the watch is slowing down. See, it, it keeps sticking. I don't know why, but it's nice to look at. See, look at that, it's a nice watch. I like it, it's a Bulova. I got this for a uh, award from when I was working with the phone company Verizon and before that it was Bell Atlantic, uh, New York Telephone, that's back in the 90s. So I really like this watch. I broke the, the glass up in Minnesota. I was uh, with my, my in-law and we were trying to put the new battery in and then we tried to squeeze it to the back here and the, and the glass. And we squeeze it without the tool, you're going to break it trying to close the back. So don't Try to close the back and force it, otherwise you'll break it. What you want to do is either you get the tool to close it. There's a tool he, the, the, the Chinese man had and he closed it. I'm going to have to buy it. I have the one to open it, but not to close it. And um, yeah, so you need that to close. Otherwise, you'll break the glass. You'll break everything. So, see, this one is not too bad. See, it's sticking. Yeah, that's not, that's not bad. I did it. I had to re... re, re, re um, I had to put the adhesive back again because when the Chinese guy he didn't put it properly so I opened it up and I put some glue but um, the watch is starting to stick sometimes so I, that's alright just for looks just display I really like the watch it's nice it's my award from working 10 years with the phone company yes so I like it it's a Bolova I don't care what it costs if it's cheap it was from Michael Sifina yeah, Michael Zifina. Alright, um, well, that's enough for that watch. Then the, the wife had this one. This is a Movado. Look at this Movado. Very nice. It works. I had to change the battery, but this one was easy. You just pry it out with a knife or something dull and thin. So that's out. And um, she have a bunch of watches. Here's more watches. I've been fixing them. This one, I put the battery in, but I couldn't close it. I got it. No, I couldn't open this one. This one was very hard. I had to take it to the... Yeah, this is a Mike. This is a Michael Coors watch. This is a Michael Coors watch. Very nice. I like it. Everybody... She thinks... My wife thinks... Um, she thinks it's, um, it's, it's a ladies' watch, but I think it's a men's watch. Well, it could be unisex. So, tell me what you think. Send me a message. Comment on it. It's a Michael Coors watch, very nice. You have one, two, three dials, plus the date. Ooh, this is nice. I'm going to wear this. 
Thanksgiving, I'm gonna wear that. And then I have, um, what else do I have? Oh, this one I was getting to work and I did this one. I put the new battery in. Oh, the battery fell out. Where the hell is the battery? Okay, I'll find. So the new battery is at 1216. This is the one I use, this 1216 battery. Where did I put it? I'll find. But see, it's a Timex. Nice Timex. So I put the battery in, it wouldn't work. So I'm gonna have to, have to look and see what's the problem. See, it's a Timex. There you go, Timex. Alright, so that's that. And now I have what I have. So that's four, and this one is a the Skagen watch. Okay, look how beautiful it's got. It's nice. See how beautiful? Look at that. Without the glass, it look really nice. So the glass is broken. So I got it. That's trying to close the back. That's it start to break up. So I got the new glass here. I'm gonna keep sanding it down. I'm gonna show you a little bit of the glass. I only put the tape for temporary. So the tape comes off on the back. I put it on both sides so in case I sand I don't scratch. I don't scratch it. I take it, you know, the beauty is in the clearness of the glass. So there. See that? So the glass, the, the two tape, I take it off. off. See? See there? There it is. <laughs> Alright. I'm laying it back so you can see. One minute and then I'm going to show you the glass. Okay, there we go. That's my headlight. <laughs> my light on my head. That's the um, thing. Today to see if you have okay, a case. Okay, you're back. You need law. Call us. Gonna, we're going to put the glass together and the Skagen watch. Car Depot's fall clearing sale. Why pay more? So we're putting pay the glass together and the Breaking skating savings watch. these specials. Choose three rooms of blood little comfort for three ninety nine. dollars one three rooms of plush comfort for five ninety nine. dollars It's your choice. Free B7. measuring, free padding, free installation, free shop at home service. We'll even laminate any room for six ninety nine. B7000 on these That's 516-731-1324. That's 516-731-1324. Visit our five showrooms B7, for a carpetipoweek.com. Science I got this from the, uh, going on in Brooklyn I think I ordered this from the uh, online and it's kind of, you know, Brooklyn team China. So I bought another one, a B6000, this came from Target. So now this is what we're going to do. What we're going to do is, uh, we're going to put some, let me see if I can bring it in close. Oh yeah, because you win, how did I know that? So I can zoom in right there. News 12 Brooklyn's What's Cool at School is brought to you by Kingsborough Community some glue College. On the inside, very lightly. You want to put it nice and light. See it right there. See a woman raped by Prospect so, Park. Police now on the hunt for her attacker. The disturbing details we're learning about this violent take assault. Your time. And it was a cold case for more than two sure decades. The young any girl in killed and left on the side of the road. The man arrested in her death, now dead. And it's one of the busiest travel days of the year. The holiday rush getting underway tonight. So what can you expect if you're heading out? It's a lot of traffic. But will you have to blast to eat? Here's Mike. All right, so we also have our friend Twerky the Turkey here talking about the holiday freeze-out that is on the way. All of his I friends are gathering around, around to give you the full forecast. That's now coming up get my, just a few minutes. My new, my new, uh, my lens for the watch. Thanks for uh, joining us here on News 12 Brooklyn. So I'm Gianna Jalosi. Our top story today, historic wildfires inside. wreaking havoc in well, California. And today, we're piece getting piece a new look at the other yeah, devastation. Yeah. Okay. This is drone footage hey. showing what's left of the town of Paris. So what I do is, Homes um, and buildings burnt to the ground. So I had marked it. Absolute destruction. So I want to line it up like this. Meanwhile, here in the city, while the hazy skies may seem then, typical for a rainy oh, November afternoon, Brooklynites may be seeing more than just clouds in the sky. News 12 Brooklyn reporter, Lena. Sauce Bank explains. 
He's made three uh, behind all, all these clouds, some of the hazy skies that you're seeing today is actually smoke to traveling all the way across Texas, the country Texas, from the California yeah. wildfires. Yeah. Take a look at this map from NOAA yeah. showing a higher yeah. density of smoke making it yeah. all the way from yeah. California yeah. to our yeah. area. Those yeah. particles making for reduced air right. quality Spot. around the five boroughs. And if you look at the shot of a New York cover, too, even though much of what you see is normal cloud cover, our meteorologist Mike Rizzo says, Oh, I forgot earlier how I got the backing. I use this. This put it cover, and then I put this like so, and I pressed down on it. But the only thing was, I didn't put the, the O-ring back. This is what prevented it from going back down properly. The rain was even falling. The rain was even falling. The rain was even falling. I don't think. I left that out because it gave me a hard time. You know, I don't think you really need that. So, yeah, so now, so once I put the, the I this is now, I can clean this later on. So now we'll just, uh, we'll just leave it, leave it to glue. I'll take my spudger and my metal spudger. See my metal spudger? This is my metal spudger. So I'll take that and I'll just clean the edge up to this. As long as it's dry though, you can clean it out later on. So, so now this one is done. Oh, All right, we have time for a check of our weather with meteorologist Mike Rizzo. All right, so that that uh, smoky layer is on. starting to show it's signs of the weather. Now the lip of it is nice and flat. See yeah, I don't see no much the lip, here, so that's good. You kind of see there's almost like an yeah, orange tinge to that sky and the horizon there. It's, it's a very thin there. layer of that smoke and left over. And then when you're done, you just pull out the tape like that. Voila! Wow, very nice. Also clearing out some of the sky conditions. I still that think that towards good. sunset you might get a pretty sunset with whatever smoke is still left over in the there upper we atmosphere, go. but it's now moving away as the new front's going to push the Just like away. new. How about that? Yeah, Check it out. Just like new. I forgot to put the comparable to a normal so hot put the light down again. There we go. Summer, however, since so there we go. Here it is. Wow, I did it. Especially like yesterday, but not as bad as nice. yesterday. Things are getting better, as you can see. The back of it. Today we have travel outlook. The front of it. It's a Skagen. It's spelled S-K-A-G-E-N. I hear it's a um, you know, it's not a reasonable price watch, I know it's how on like a hundred bucks on the internet, so we'll, um, I'm going to research that, it's a pretty nice watch, I like this watch, it's a ladies watch, but it's nice, so this will give it a nice new I'll Local clean that up later. Delays. New York Airport still experiencing some delays from earlier yeah, effects from the bad. weather. However, right. again, please check with your carrier before heading right. to those airports to confirm well, that your Thanks for watching. If you have any schedule. comments, Northwest send me a coming comment. Through right now, picking up the pace here, 10 to 15 miles right. per hour, allowing so for that smoky go. layer to get pushed off. The next watch I'll be working on is the Timex. So the Timex stopped working. Tonight's low will be see, 35 and tomorrow will be cold. It stopped Apple. working, so no, I gotta see. I changed the battery, but it still won't work. Right, thanks, Mike. The battery's still on. Crime now as the NYPD nature.